Hello and welcome. My name is Christoph and uh, I run the IT Career Guide Questions uh, YouTube channel. And uh, in today's video, I want to talk about the uh, Microsoft Certified Systems Engineer. So um, I've got this certificate here. Um, I hope you can read it. Um, in the year 2000, um, I acquired the um, title from Microsoft. I am a Microsoft Certified Professional Systems Engineer. So I used this actually uh, really to excel my career in IT. If you've watched my previous video where I explained to you how I became Microsoft certified and how I broke into IT, um, I took that journey a little further. And um, roughly a year later after I had my first job in IT, um, I became a Microsoft certified professional slash systems engineer. So I completed the entire track uh, back then it was for Windows NT4 uh, combined with uh, Windows 95 um, and uh, that was the way how I got certified and then I used that systems engineer title really to excel in my career and to find new positions later on and really shift away from tech support uh, which I enjoyed doing to a certain degree uh, but I wanted to move further up. I wanted to really take this and um, make it a real career, not just work a job for a long time. So uh, being a certified uh, systems engineer, I was able to um, show the right credentials to employers. And I was able, with a little bit of luck, of course, um, to move into new positions. So I worked in tech support um, for a little bit and uh, kept studying. And with more certifications under my belt, I found a position. Um, it was not necessarily a computer operator position, but um, the work was kind of a computer operator and then slash systems administrator. It was a small office. There were about 10 people and the company was just uh, acquired by a larger company. So this was an office for software development. They had written software for Wall Street. And um, the software was so successful that uh, they got bought out um, by another company. And uh, so now they had uh, much more funding. And um, so they hired uh, people like myself um, to help with the company growth. So I came in, I ran the daily database production to move the financial data from the previous uh, stock trading day into the database so that the financial software could then uh, do its magic. So with that position, um, I did the computer operator task and it was about two to three hours a day. And then for the rest of the day, um, I was the system administrator for the small office. And uh, that's really where I spent about um, roughly four years with this company and uh, learned the most because for me, it was really like a, almost a lab, uh, a lab environment where I could experiment. I mean, I was encouraged to experiment. Um, because we were writing software and uh, we were moving fast. Um, we were doing some really advanced stuff at that time. And um, so the environment where I worked needed to grow and provide uh, background and services that the software developers needed to write better code and to deliver a better product. So that systems engineer's title uh, really helped me to address the concerns during the interview because I had only some tech support of several months on my uh, resume. Um, I, there wasn't really a lot of IT history and um, having the uh, certification and um, some, some work experience and good interview skills, don't underestimate those, it really helped me to get into that job. And that's how I really got into my first job as a system administrator where I was able then to take that knowledge that I acquired and combine it with the systems engineer certification. And that really, in the end, was the, the biggest stepping stone in my career because then after those four years that I mentioned, I had a lot of work experience. I had a great certificate sitting behind me that um, proved that I um, actually not just worked a job, but I, take, I took the knowledge and then acquired a really um, challenging certification. So I hope this video was helpful. Um, if you haven't, um, please subscribe to my channel. Um, I would also appreciate it if you leave a like um, for this video and make sure to watch my other videos. I will upload videos uh, weekly. And in those videos, we talk about how to become certified, how to break into information technology, how to pass um, challenging job interviews and uh, how to turn this into a fun and fulfilling career that even pays well. Thanks and have a great day. See you next time. Bye-bye.